Hello YouTube, this is Tom from Tom's Garage and today I'm going to show you what you need and how you can install your oil temperature or oil pressure gauge. You can buy these gauges from Wish and eBay or bigger car shops. I purchased this from Wish and this was in the box. The gauge, the temperature sensor and the cable for it. It is quite simple, but you need to buy one more thing to install this gauge to your car. What you need to buy is a sandwich adapter, so you can install your oil temperature sensor under your oil filter. As you can see on it, it has got three holes, and in this case we have a nut set, so it is good for most cars. You might want to ask, where to put that adapter. Imagine my left hand as your oil filter nut. Normally, when you change your oil filter, you just put up your new filter and you are done. Now, this is what you need to do. First, you need to give a small oil layer to the rubber seal with your finger. Then you need to tighten your sandwich adapter with the nut they gave to the set. After that add a small oil layer to the oil filter sealing and as normal put on your oil filter and your sandwich adapter is now installed to your engine. Before you install your sandwich adapter, you need to put the temperature sensor to a hole where the oil reaches the sensor most. The other holes can be used for other oil lines for your turbo or to your oil pressure sensor. If you don't want to use them, Put in those screws they gave to the set. Of course, you need to tighten all the nuts and screws. I'm just showing you what to do with them. Then, you need to wire and install your gauge inside your car. For the oil temperature gauge, there will be three cables. The red will be your 12 volts switched power cable, the black will be your ground and the green one will be your cable to the sensor. The cables are not so long, so you will have to extend the three cable. And this is going to be the result. You can buy gauge holders, some cars have more specific ones, and you can mount it somewhere in front of you. So this was my installing tip for your gauge. Hope you know now what to do with it. If you found the video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. See you next time, bye bye.